Hi, I'm Laurie Minson from Tamworth in Australia. Uh, it's April 2019. Uh, I'm going to do a demo video of a new pedal I've just finished building. Um, it's a sort of an updated version of my M7. Uh, I'm going to use a Telecaster because I thought single coil, if I can get our fat sound out of this, then uh, you've got a pretty good chance of being able to do it with just about any other guitar. So uh, we're going to get into it here. Uh, this is the new Mince and Custom Pedals M7. Uh, okay, so I've just got a tuner at the front end here. And then uh, the first effect is a compressor. The uh, adjustments for the amount of compression and the output are internal in little trim pots. So I've just got an on off switch for it. Ah, oh, it's a pretty decent sounding compressor. I should take that reverb off. There's a pull switch on that. There we go. Just so. Here's a clean. There's the compressor. Nice uh, little bit of um, push there. Okay, uh, now this is the big new effect. Uh, I've had this dingo drive for a while, but um, what I've got now is actually a master. So you can kind of think of this basically like um, uh, gain, which will uh, give you the amount of drive and volume, which is a master. So, I'm not sure how I've got it set here at the moment. Oh, yeah, so it's pretty much clean. So you can have it as a clean boost, pretty much, if you just want to sort of do something like that. Uh, then, pulling the master back and winding the gain up. Got a lot of increments of gain here. Winding, you hear it start to break. Now it's going to get louder uh, as I crank the gain up, so I'm probably going to need to compensate a bit with the master there. Okay, and then uh, I'll just wind him fully up. Okay, so that's pretty much. The uh, new feature with this drive is you've got a master volume, which is, I think, really handy. Uh, the next drive is a bit more like a tube screamer. It's a big and chunky output stage style drive. Now, it'll start breaking straight away, and then as you wind the gain up, it'll get bigger. In the chain, um, you've got compressor and then the first drive and then the second drive so you can kind of chain them um, so I'll go from, from this guy here okay and then we can add this one pretty chunky and then the compressor will just push a little bit more and you can hear for a Telecaster that's that's pretty chunky uh, the rest of the pedal is the same as most of my other ones. Uh, you've got a tremolo with a speed control for the rate of tram. Okay, uh, next in the chain, there's a, a delay, nice sounding delay. You've got everything from uh, sort of long repeats um, through to you know, short. The tap tempo overrides the time knob, so you can sort of see that one going boom, 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 quick, and then if I tap in a different time, it'll change it and go slow. Um, mix is just for the amount of effect and feedback's the amount of repeat, so you can get everything from, you know, a rockabilly kind of thing with lots of mix, short slap time. Here we go, come on. Through to, um, you know, a longer delay time, not so much mix, this type of thing. Okay, so nice sounding delay. Uh, now we've got a reverb. Now, the reverb, this has just got a mix control, so you can run it normal gig. 
mix is about there somewhere. If you want to get rid of it, there is a that's a blend knob. If you want to take it completely out of the chain, which makes it true bypass, there's a pull pull switch there. Um, wind it up, you'll get maximum reverb. So there's a fair bit there. Um, normal gig, sort of is somewhere between one and two o'clock. That kind of. Of course, you can have the delay on as well. boost uh, which also works as a cut so somewhere about halfway about 12 o'clock is, is about unity gain um, so if you wind him back works as a cut uh, that works good if you've got the big drives going um, but then if you just want a clean boost more of the same just crank it up and it's quite smooth too it's not real jumpy so so look, there it is. There's a um, there's a balanced line output here. Uh, if you want to go into a PA or to a uh, recording device, into an interface, um, comes with a little pouch made by my mate Michael Talbot. Um, that's pretty cool. Uh, so um, there it is, the new Minson M7 2019 model.